TV. I am Maria. This is Cowboy Doctor. If this is your first time watching MRTV and <laughs> the doctor that's a cowboy, consider subscribing. Then hit that notification bell for upcoming videos. Get us a thumbs up and share us out. Don't keep us to yourself and leave us a comment. That's how you get to know each other. Far return of Fountain. We love you all. I'm excited, cowboy. I'm a, so, so, all right. So, so, Ooh, we two. We had. We are having chopped cheese today. Alrighty, with the kettle jalapeno chips in the middle. I got a little afternoon tail right here for you. You know, y'all said, "Dang, cowboy got some what?" Yeah, yes. <laughs> Let's get into the blessing. Thank you, Holy Father, for this food. We're about to receive in your Son Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Look, guys. We just jumped out the kitchen. For those who's in the live, here we go. For those who went, thanks for being here. And go check out the live on how I made these. All right, so we're going to get to eating. I'm going to try to hold it up the best I can to give y'all a little bite. But these boys is huge. There you go, right there. Ooh, these things got a little fire on it. Yeah, the jalapeno. Oh, I know. Yeah, there you go, that toast. Yes, I got to eat now. Let's take a page out of Big Bang Bob and mm -hmm. Miss Shan book. Mm -hmm. And do like this. Poop. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Everybody out there is wondering, and they the cowboy ain't got no cowboy hat on today. I just come from my doctor's practice, doing a little bit of therapy. Couple, you know how I did. Mm -hmm. so, anytime y'all see me wearing this hat, y'all know I just come from my practice. Mm. Mm. I like that. I asked y'all in the. On the, who was in the live? What don't I have on my sandwich? So I want y'all to put it down there. What don't I have on my sandwich? Mm. Oh, that should have got me some uh, jalapenos. Don't mean the mild, you know, whatever you call them. Oh, pepper Yeah, mm. that's okay. You want me to get them? Oh, you go. Mm. Mm. That's my first time having it. This is so good. Any of y'all out there can put this whole thing in your mouth? Maybe this way. I'm going to put my whole foot in yours. Here back. I'm going to ask a question. A legitimate mm -mm. question. Mm -mm. I got a story. Mm. Cruncher. So anything that crunch, I love it. And Mark mm. go to the store to buy some stuff. I told her bring me back a bag of chips, y'all. She brought me back a bag of skins. Skins is chips. Dead in the text. I ain't verbally say it. Put it in the chat. Put it in the text, y'all. When you say chips, <clears throat> I think skins is in the chip family. Y'all heard that? I want y'all to put that down in the comment. Now, one thing about y'all, y'all gonna tell it like it is. <laughs> so, <laughs> I want y'all to put that down. She said, skins is in the chip family. Keep it real. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
So, it won't be yesterday when y'all see this. But as it stands right now, yesterday, we went to the park. Because it was like 77 degrees here in Michigan. So, we went to the park. Park, just, you know, chill out. Watch folks, you know, crack up and all that type of stuff. And at this park, Ruish Park, for those who stay in Michigan, you know, people be out there cooking, selling food. It, it's all type of stuff, you know. We saw a soul food truck pull up in there. It was a lady at the front selling pineapple liquor drinks. That ain't all she was selling, <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> so. Allegedly. <laughs> <laughs> Allegedly, right. <laughs> so. Oh my gosh, this is good. Mm -hmm. This is crazy. Mm -hmm. and, the, and the thing about she only made one. We have more left. <clears throat> so anyway, the lady at the front who was selling the pineapple drinks, she was also, she had a little bit of a little grill. Probably what, it wasn't even big as this thing right here. Park grill, y'all. Y'all know the park grill. Yeah. And she had on top of the table, she had hamburger, salmon. What else she had? Salmon. Cause she said she had hibachi. She had she was selling kebabs with rice, kebabs, mm -hmm. rice, mm -hmm. and salmon. Mhm. Mm rice. Pay attention. Rice and salmon. Salmon. Hamburgers and hot dog. All out of trunk. On this one grill. And she was working out of trunk. So. I was like, you know, we was both like, okay, we don't care. You know, everybody out there trying to make a little extra ends me. She went in the trunk and came up out the trunk. I kid you not. She was patting hamburgers with her raw hand. No glove, no winter glove, plastic glove, latex glove. <laughs> Took it, put it on the grill. Next to whatever the hell else was out there. Then, people was pulling up asking her, you know, about the drink. She went and took a dry paper towel and washed her hands off when she was just patting a raw amber. And started messing with their pineapple drink with her. She had bottled water that they was pouring on their hand. But this time she didn't pour no water. She just dried it off and went to see. Mm -mm. I ain't mess with nobody on how they get their in. But you have to have sanitation. Well, no, I, it, it, you, you can't just be pouring water out of a water bottle over your hands, you know. For sanitation reasons, I'm going to need you to get that part together. And maybe already had a hamburger, bun, hamburger patties patted out, you know, when you get there, right? Everything should already be set to go. She was having a core of pineapples. Her table was kind of, you know, because you had to get in there with that core. And she should have already had her pineapples cored. And they that would have made life a lot easier for them. Because she ended up, at first she was by herself, then she had got some help. You know, the only thing that would make the story more funnier. Mm -hmm. If she was a member of your channel. <laughs> <laughs> but she would know we just be true. You know, for real. Like I said, I don't knock nobody's hustle. At all. She looked like she was straight coming from Hooters. You know, allegedly. She had a little tank shirt. She had it all out. Have it out. I guess they say that's what they call that kind of stuff. Sale. She only had her boobs out. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And her stomach. 
Nah, that's what you're not gonna do. You're not about to start. I know one thing. This was a good A sandwich. But my whole point was just be careful if you're gonna buy food and stuff from people that's just, you know, they're just trying to get their side hustle on. I get it. But I know if I paid attention to it, somebody else did. But people, that was kind of how much she was selling the for? What was the what you got? Twenty dollars. Mm -hmm. Pineapple drink. Mm -hmm. And five dollars for, a for refill. A refill. Mm -hmm. Now my question was, I wonder could I bring that same pineapple back today <laughs> and get me a five dollar refill? <laughs> <laughs> Which I think that five dollar refill is cutting them short. Because think about it. Everything you quit. So what you're saying is, because I already got the pineapple now, so I don't need that. And you're saying the liquor, you're charging me $5 for that. Now am I getting less liquor? Am I getting the same amount of liquor? And so you taking a $15 loss. I don't know if that... Think of people will come back. You know, usually people will say, let's just say two for 20, one for 15. You know, because I need to get my hook up. I need, you know, not that, but she was like this. Mm -hmm. And that probably why she stayed busy. People were coming back for that damn five dollar refill. Giving the, giving the pineapple to somebody else, but like, here, you can take this up there and get your five dollar. Wow. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. I did not think of that. Mm-mm-mm. All right, when I give, when I sell stuff and give it away, I get the first one away for free, then I charge for the second one. Well, clearly you know what time it's about to be. All we right, just everybody. want to come and sit down Thank and have our chop coming. Beef. See the doctor, cowboy. Yeah, if y'all have one of these, I got to get back to my practice. Use brioche bun. Got a little coughing to do. Well, this hot dog might be a divorce. Who knows? Mm, mm, mm. I might can straighten them out. And these jalapeno kettle chips went perfect. The wife might just need a taste of a different man. I need to get back with her husband. Who knows? Mm -mm. See you going. Mm -mm. So, until the next time we meet and see each other, mm -mm. I thank each and every one of you <coughs> for coming out on this day. And <coughs> until I see you again, Ooh, remember <coughs> one thing and two things the that the doctor uh -uh. and the cowboy have in common <coughs> is these hands.